Q here. Welcome to the channel. We have Delight on the bottom of the deck, which is 10 cups or 10 paintings. A complete dream. Hmm. So let's shuffle up. And again, hey everyone. And, uh, let's dive into this focus reading for the day as we have patience for the secrets to tag along. <laughs> but then I want you to look at sharing a moment with everyone as the Ten of Music shows up, which is sublimity. It's the Ten of Wands, but it doesn't give off that because it's uniting everybody. And the mystery of life is what we're going to commit ourselves to. Just because you read the book once doesn't mean you got all the details, uh, says the High Priestess. So the Divine wants you to focus on uniting everybody around sublimity and make sure that you keep rereading. It's different every time as the path forward is taking that energy and making it a maelstrom of mm, transformation, which is what we fear. We, trans we fear what we have to transform. Jealousy. Mm. And it's experience. And boldly crafted into melancholy by practicing patience. <laughs> All right, that's what's up. Um, practice discipline. Be loud and proud. And be careful of your distractions. And harmony brings delight and makes eternity sufferable. Especially of all the pain and suffering. Especially when you bring the energy of cups. Alright. A secret held. <laughs> uh, can we turn that into a ladybug? Yeah, why not? So, I'm a, I am Moldavite. Aries, Gemini. Oh, sorry. Taurus, Gemini. Cancel. Um, Leo? Okay. Leo, Virgo, Libra, Scorpio, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Aquarius, and Pisces. And we get our overall energy because it was on the bottom of the deck when we started. A delight. So I guess that'll be our... Um, our zodiac sign as well too. I'm squishing in since I'm running late. So Aries, unite and get everybody excited. Taurus, reread that book of life. Gemini, use the energy that's around you to transform everything. Cancer, um, things that weren't solid are being broken down for you, Leo. And someone's coming towards you with a new expression of love. Eternity, you've been in this round and round. They are coming. <laughs> practice, 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 practice. Whatever it is you're focusing on there, Scorpio, be careful of distractions there, Sagittarius. Be loud and beautiful, Capricorn, and have the discipline to know when you should leave, uh, Aquarius, and harmony, a commitment there for you, Pisces. Hmm. And since it'll be extended, I'll take death here, transformation, which I'm getting off more so the magic card here, which is the magician. And because it's fueled with passion and love. All right. So let's throw three cards out and just kind of create a consensus or um, just a governing feel for this. As I saw the Queen of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles nurture integrity about the thing that you've been keeping your eye on. I'll compliment the overall energy as those flimsy excuses from my personal reading uh, falls into here. Commitment, that contract and the portal towards that commitment is a solid and stable, so pursue it. Don't be indecisive. I see it like this, so sideways. See the green point points us to um, 
the commitment now. And again, all I see is the butterfly there. So um, we'll pull another. Yeah, make a choice. The energy that I was speaking of on there inspired to cut. After we make that choice, we go from excuses to a turn in the right direction, which is truth. And truth is always liberating. Oops, feeling that. Oh, look at that beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful symmetry. Lib uh, liberated and independent by uh, speaking truth and making a decision in truth will get you independence and fulfilled emotionally. The very thing that temperance is suggesting there that you walk towards a wheel spinning and reciprocity. They're egos. <laughs> and that's what's coming to an end. Oh, full circle. I like it. So, full circle it. That decision puts you in temperance, which is the best lesson of the tarot. Oh, I didn't see the justice cats. And that's what they want you to walk towards, which brings balance. And a balanced um, meeting of minds is happy meetings of minds. That gets the wheel going. And reciprocity and that miracle energy that takes and ends the dominance of ego and turns it into passion. Um, confirmed by what love does to a king snake as it turns it into a passion ready to explode. And instead of being fake, it's protective and beautiful and bold. That quick change energy. Nice. All right, well, there you have it. Um, adult yourself with this energy here. If you like the vibe, um, like, subscribe, share. <laughs> um, that's, I guess, helpful reminder. It reminds me when I'm watching videos. So if you like me, help me grow. And if you're in a dark space, behold liberation. Q's got you.